Hi, I'm Jason. This is a Razer Black Widow X Chroma, and you're watching Jason's Tech. One thing. Uh, there's a small announcement at the end of this video. Stay tuned for that. Let's get into this intro now. Razer Black Widow X Chroma. Chroma just means it's RGB. It uses their Chroma software to enhance gameplay, have lighting effects, blah blah blah, all the things that RGB keyboards do. The Black Widow X only comes with Razer green switches. The Black Widow has green and orange switches. Green switches are a lot like the Cherry MX Blues and the orange switches are a lot like the Cherry MX Browns. Um, they claim 80 million clickies, clickies being a technical term metal plate I'm guessing a steel this keyboard is quite heavy and I like that because that means it takes more energy to move it back and forth when you're playing when you're matching on the keys it's not sliding back and forth of course as rear feet has stand so you could change the angle low or high so there's a couple lighting effects I'm doing some screen capture so we'll switch over to the screen right now and as you can see there's some lighting some different lighting effects from you know the wave there's this just cycling through all the different colors there's this breathing one which will switch between two colors uh, there's a reactive one as you see as you just type they fade to black there's a ripple effect and then there's just there's 60 million colors i mean you could choose it from any of these colors and these colors are really good um i've been playing with the colors a lot and I found my favorite colors were turquoise on the keyboard. The reds look really red, they don't look pink. Um, the blues are great. So, I mean, it really comes down to your preference of color. Uh, on top of that, they have a bunch of macro keys. They also have uh, function keys on here to dim the lights, play, pause, volume up and down. It has 10 key rollover with anti-ghosting. It's on the fly macro recording. It has a braided cable. The Black Widow X is missing a couple features. Audio pass through, a secondary USB port on it. Um, these features, but I wasn't looking for those features in the keyboard, so it didn't really matter to me. I wanted a very clean looking keyboard. And that's what I got. I got a very awesome looking clean keyboard. It's a metal design plate with the keys placed on top of the plate so the light shines through the keys. Also bounces off the bottom in this nice looking floating design. I really enjoy. This keyboard's not very good in an office environment, mostly because it's a loud keyboard, but it's a very enjoyable keyboard to write on. This is the best gaming keyboard I've ever used. Mark you, this is the first gaming keyboard I've ever really used, and there isn't a reason for me to go out and buy another one for personal use, but in the future, I will be reviewing more keyboards, and this will be the yardstick I measure everything else up against. So, uh, I wanna know your experience with the Black Widow X Chroma. Leave a comment below and tell me about how you like your keyboard. So let me give you a little background story on why I bought myself a new keyboard. Uh, a couple nights ago, I was doing some video editing, I had headphones on, I turned around to go play with the stereo behind me, and then guess what? My headphone cable knocks over my soda onto my keyboard. Luckily, nothing else on the desk got damaged by the soda. My old keyboard is nothing to cry about. It's an I Power keyboard, came with Alexander. So I cleaned it out with some alcohol and water and then some more alcohol and then put it in a bag of rice. Let it sit for about 12 hours. I come up to the morning and find out the keyboard is dead dead. It won't do anything, not a single key. So go to Amazon Prime now, order my for Razer Black Widow X. Two hours later, I have a new keyboard and I'm back to work. Thank you, Amazon Prime now. All right, so thank you for watching. Like, share, and comment. And if you want to hear about the special announcement, here we go. 
Hey, you made it to the end of my video. So, my big announcement is I'm giving away a GTX 960. The GTX 960 came out of War Machine after I did an update to the RX 480. It's been sitting in a closet. It is working, it is used, so take that in mind. To qualify for this giveaway, you need to be subscribed to this channel and live in North America. I will, the drawing will happen the moment I hit 1,000 subscribers. And I will email you through YouTube telling you that you have won. So, like, subscribe, comment, and I'll see you soon.